Coach Anthony here with the Way of Life Boot Camp, and I'm here to talk about goals. Uh, check that link down there below. Click on it. And uh, I'm just really here to give you the best value that I can at this moment with what I know. And uh, what I do know is how to change uh, or give the opportunity for people to change mind, body, and soul. In the last couple of years, uh, there's been 10,000 pounds released at our boot camp, at the Way of Life Boot Camp, uh, with me and the amazing coach Forrest Follin. Uh, also, too, uh, what has happened within those last two years is we've been showcased with Deepak Chopra and Oprah Winfrey. Um, they sent us out uh, to a million people because they recognized us as the mind, body, soul, fitness experts. That's huge, Oprah Winfrey and Deepak Chopra, for them to be able to see that and, and want to go with us. Um, and there's been a couple other things, but let, let's not get too much into that. What I want to talk about today is goals and how to achieve those. There's so many different you know, great books and research that you could do on goals and how to, to uh, be able to uh, attain them. Uh, you know, the approach by Brian Grasso, uh, Mindset Performance Institute. Um, and I'll tell you, but uh, 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 he's a world changer. Him and Kerry Campbell, uh, or Kerry Grasso, Kerry Campbell Grasso, and those are our coaches too as well in the Mindset Performance Institute. I believe that their way as far as changing the mind is, you know, the best way, the subconscious. And they have, um, they have the tools to be able to make that happen through the Institute that me and Coach Forrest are so happy to, to have. you got Brian Tracy, um, which is a sales expert, but he has a lot of different tips on goals. So many people. Uh, Jim Rohn, uh, Les Brown, the list goes on about goals. Um, but what I, what I found uh, that really helps and works with your goals is not being vague. I talked about that um, in our last uh, segment on goals, uh, not being vague. You know, for example, it's three months from now, uh, I'm going to release 17 pounds. I'm headed to Florida uh, to uh, speak at a nonprofit for my brother Bo at Fit for Truth. Uh, and so I want to be in, in the right shape to be able to speak to the kids that are going to be there. This guy's doing an amazing thing out there, Bo. Um, wants a foster a kid himself and understand what that life is coming up. But now as a uh, took in the, what he's gone through and get, now has the tools to be able to help foster kids right now. And so I, I get the honor to be able to speak there, as does Coach Forrest Follin. And so I want to be in tip-top condition because I want to tell them, hey, your body's critical. It's the only vehicle you have, right? So you can't be vague with your goals. I think some of us are very vague. You got to say, hey, this is what I'm going to do by this certain date. So I'm going to lose 17 pounds by October 10th. It's July right now, 28th. So I got around three months to be able to get that done, right? Um... If and then, or if, if and then. So an example is, if I don't read 10 pages of this inspirational book by noon today, then I will make sure to read those 10 pages by the time I go to bed at 9 o'clock tonight. If and then, it ups your percentage. 91% of people that do that, that write it down in their goals, they get it done. I tell you what. I, I'm active on taking action, and I took an action on this. I read a book, um, and I talked about that book, and I still got to find it on prior goals videos. But I read that book, and it just it helped me as I was on my way to New York and Connecticut uh, for our Mind, Mindset Performance Institute Summit that we had. And I'll tell you what, that book was amazing. And I've been doing that already, and I'll tell you what, my goals have been reached. Um, and so then also too, you become, you write in your journal, the journal is the most important. So you get a journal, 99 cents at the 99 cent store. I'm buying 40 of them for our Saturday boot camp this week, right? And passing those out. And I'll be speaking on this, this Saturday, 9am at Stills Full Body uh, Saturday. And that's, uh, and, and that's what we'll be talking about is those three things, you know, getting it in your journal, not being vague. And the if, if, and then I will make it happen type thing, right? So these are this is really critical. So when you write it down in your journal, and then you can even become more descript, what you can do is you can say, okay, hey, I'm going to, um, you know, I broke it down into I'm going to have to have 90 workouts by that time. Um, I'm going to have to make sure that I do my way of life 21-day detox. I'm probably going to get on a keto plan. I can eat if I like to, have a, one cheat meal a week if I want to, or forget the cheat, earn meal right? One earn meal if I like to, okay? Plus 90 workouts, and that will have me more than ready. And so sometimes you want to just break it down like that too as well as you get stronger into your goals. So you have a great day, Coach Anthony with the Way of Life Boot Camp.